You've got a friend in me When the road looks rough ahead and you're Good news. The movie, Disney Pixar film Toy Story 3, is out. Came out June 18th. All good. I actually saw it June 20th. I couldn't see it today because I was day of because I was on vacation in South Dakota. And I actually got a chance to interview uh, Tina50, so I'll be able to show you guys that. Let's get on to the main point, Toy Story 3. I saw the film, saw a couple trailers for it, um, Narnia 3, that's coming. But the thing I'm really ticked off about is it's made by, it's not made by Disney. It's made by 20th Century Fox, which really ticks me off. It's just real stupid. I'm going to talk about that in a different video. Legends of the Guardians, about this owl tribe and stuff they go find in the Guardians, and this owl becomes a Guardian. That looks really good. Hoping to see that one when it comes out. Despicable Me. And then I was hoping to see um, a trailer for a new sh um, Pixar movie, but they didn't show it, so I believe it's going to be Cars 2 next. We'll talk about that later. Let's get on to Toy Story 3. I loved it. The second it started, I was smiling the entire movie. It was it was great. I love the film, I love the characters, I love how it ended, I love the beginning, middle, climax, ending. It always kept you on the edge of your seat. And even the heartful ending of the film almost put me in tears. I'm serious. I almost cried. I don't want to tell you I really do want to tell you guys, but I can't, because it's a movie. You gotta see it to see it. People say Toy Story 4. I don't know. It could be possible. But wait and see. Anyways, Toy Story 3 was a great movie. Um, when I was there, when I got to the theater, I got this really cool book. It's a Lego Toy Story um, magazine. And as you can see on the cover, you got um, Buzz Lightyear, Woody, an Army Man, Alien, Ham. You got another alien here, and Jesse, and Bullseye, and next even a Rex figure, and a lot of hug in there. As you can see, Lego Toy Story 3. And yeah, this is really cool book, um, with a bunch of awesome stuff. So, uh, building Lego contest, how to draw Lego Woody, Pixar interviews, games, and on the back is a check checklist of Lego sets you could possibly get. Oh, I'm looking forward to getting, um, I'm looking forward to getting, uh, this, this one right here, the RC, the RC one, was Buzz and Woody, and then also this one right down here with Lotso, Stretch, and Chunk, and then this one right here, and then DVD Vix if he wants to get this one, this train set, and then I want to try to get this dump set. If you want to see what this is about, this is the most exciting part in the film. The most really, really scary part in the movie. What's going to happen? I can't tell. So in that um, magazine, it had this uh, gigantic pull-out poster. As you can see, there's lots of on this side. And you can see uh, Chunk and Twitch and all the other characters. And you see Prospector and Buzz and Woody. You see the new toys. Along with the old toys. Really cool. Then, also, I got the, uh, when I was in South Dakota, I got the US, USA Today newspaper. And Toy Story 3 was on there. And I'll pull out the article real quick. Uh, the review did, really didn't make a lot of sense. I think the wording of it, people, but some of the wording was a little screwed up. Uh, actually, I got a couple of those. Yeah, so I got this, um, I was at Best Buy, I got this Harry Potter, um, Lego game thing. Here's one through four, that's coming out soon. Go ahead and get that. Um, of course here's the game, and that comes out June 29th. This game, Toy Story 3, the video game. And here's what the Best Buy description says. Okay, it says, Revisit the toy box with Woody, Buzz, Lightyear, Jesse, and the gang, and fun this fun adventure based on the third installment of the Toy Story saga. As Andy heads off for college, his, devo his devoted toys find themselves left behind, locked in a room with a group of wild children. Whack wacky chaos follows as the toys adapt to their new surroundings and try to stay together. Can you help the toys ensure no toy gets left behind? 
That's how you play the game in story mode. Story box mode, you know what it is. I described it to you. It's just this amazing thing where you can create your own world, technically. That's technically what it is. Also, if you get on PS3, you get an exclusive... You get to play exclusively as the character Zerg. Now, Zerg does make an appearance in Toy Story 3. Then, it, with Wii or Nintendo DS, you get a $5 ca concession cash. So you can buy some concessions when you go see the movie. And by the way, Toy Story 3 is the movie of the week, and it's the bomb. I definitely recommend this movie. Four stars and four stars. Oh, I almost forgot. The new Pixar movies. What's coming up next after this? Well, Pixar Canada is also obviously working on new um, stop mo new short films for Toy Story. Toy Story, yeah. They're making short films for Toy Story. I'm really excited for that. Can't wait to see that. And, I, and then they're making shorts for Cars, continuing that. And the new movie is going to be Cars 2, I believe. I believe that's what's going to happen. The story is Lightning goes off to Europe with Mater and stuff, and they all go on an adventure and stuff. Apparently Doc Hunts is not going to be in the film because obviously Paul Newman died, like, two months after the film came out on DVD. So I'm sorry to say, but Doc Hudson will not be in Cars 2. But after Cars 2, I hear, um, you all remember Monsters Incorporated, right, Mike? Yeah, blame it on the little guy. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, pal, I didn't mean to blame it on you. Hey, what's that over there? Where? Oh! <laughs> Dad, a Shut up. <laughs> sorry. Anyways, Monsters Inc., you all remember that? Well, I've heard the news that there is going to be Monsters Inc. 2. It's been confirmed that Monsters Inc. 2 is going to be coming out. That's the next two Pixar films. So after Cars 2, it's Monsters Inc. 2. What's the plot? I believe what the storyline is... This is a lot like Toy Story 3, I think. The plot is Andy... Andy. I'm thinking of Toy Story. Sorry. See, this is a lot like Toy Story, I think. But in Monsters Inc. 2... It's been a few years since the Boo incident, and uh, everybody's all calm and safe now. And uh, Mike and Sully go into, since they have access to Boo's door, they can visit her anytime they want. So they go and visit her, and they realize that she's all grown up. She's a teenager. And her real name is Jessica. So they can't really call her Boo anymore, they just call her Jessica. Or I don't know if they do or do not, but you know. So they're stuck with that, and um, they he, they have to help her with her love life. She has this boyfriend she falls in love with, this guy she falls in love with, and they, she has, they have to help him. And as they go on, they have to realize that she's grown up, and there's nothing they can do about it, and she's moved on. I mean, she doesn't hate them, but she just is grown up. This is a lot like Toy Story, because in Toy Story 3, Andy... Or the toys have to let go and just realize that Andy's grown up and he doesn't need some toys anymore. I'm do looking forward to get. I do look forward to getting the Toy Story collection. Um, I did saw a review for the Mr. Potato Head. It looks like a fantastic toy. I want to save my money up for that. Hopefully, I can get it. Fifty dollars. They're all fifty dollars, by the way. I don't know why. It's really stupid. They should be. Potato Head should be at least forty dollars. I think that's good in range. Lots of Hug and Bear. I'm definitely going to get Buzz Let Your Woody. I'll try to get all of them. But anyways, that's it. We're going to wrap up our show. Thanks for watching. Once again, Toy Story 3 is now playing. It's the movie of the week, and I definitely recommend this for movie. And also, Cars 2 comes out um, June 24th, 2011. Monsters, Inc. 2. That comes out June... I think, I'm pretty sure it's June. June 16th, 2012. Then also, really quick... The Pixar short, Pixar movie, The Bear and the Bow, that's been changed to Brave. Why? I don't know. The Newt, I believe, is still on. I don't know about any, the rest of the films. Thanks for watching the Big Beast 75 show, and I'll have some other v videos up for you. And until then, I'll be Big Beast 75, and thanks for watching the Big Beast 75. Miles and miles from your nice warm bed. You just remember what your old past said. Boy, you got a friend in me Yeah, you got a friend in me You got a friend in me